I'm Rohit Jha. I'm Amanda Pustis. I'm Marissa Ryan. And we created Posture Corrector, a posture de measuring device to determine correct posture. And as our slogan is, we've got your back. <laughs> <laughs> so show me the sensor there. So we have a about four, four point five inch, five inch uh, from plus Spark sensor Fun. from Spark Fun. Um, we sewed and stapled the two ends to a piece of belt right here, which is velcroed onto the shirt so that the user can remove it off the shirt if they don't want it on there. Okay. And right above it, we have a single vibration motor. And the reason why we included a vibration motor was you can look on a screen and you can tell you that you're in a poor posture state. But if you have a physical indicator, it's much better and it provides a sort of annoying factor that immediately makes the user want to correct themselves into a correct posture. And it's in the appropriate place course, to, yes. to give you the we indication. We tried to find the most annoying place on the back. <laughs> yes, and did they And did they do that? They succeeded. They succeeded, yes. okay. <laughs> so, uh, so set it up now. There's a calibrate mode, right? Yes. So you... So this so is the home screen. Home screen, yep. And then, so you have a single button. Um, and then we click through twice. Mm -hmm. I need a security down. So she just sits up for a certain number of time. The bar will say... Okay, now hold that posture. So you're sitting up in a in a straight configuration. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the bar has now said it's completely full, so it's saying it's been calibrated. So now we um, can so now can go to the make, the next screen, which is a body which outline. Which is a body outline, yeah. And the All green right. bar is the sensor. Okay, and now as you slump, it turns red. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I'm going to try and see if I can. Okay, so this is slumped flash. and straight. And as the red at the same. Concurrently, when the red bar uh, occurs, the vibration sensor on her back is false. Okay, now do do do, do a do a slump. Yeah, that's perfect. Do do a slump and straight a slump, and straight. Okay, now I'm going to get down here where I can hear the motor. Okay. Well, okay, I can hear the motor. I hope the camera yeah. can. <laughs> so then the other thing we have is. Um, a screen that counts the number of times that the red bar occurred. Um, we call it backbreakers in, in our um, in our system. And so you're 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 flexing your back, and the and the and the count is increasing. Mm -hmm. Correct. And, and and then the button when, with the button push. You can toggle kind, between the two. Kind of like we would model it after a Fitbit, so you can toggle between uh, stat menus. So between so the body just, image and the number of backbreakers. You can toggle between them depending on which one you want to see. Okay, and the goal in the final version of this would be to have it miniaturized on a wrist. Mm -hmm. right. So kind of like a Fitbit, so a wearable device. Correct. And potentially making this wireless so that, like a Fitbit, you can put the stats on the computer or on the watch or So you can you use it while you're driving or doing other various or you tasks. Make a phone or app you don't have necessarily the option of wireless. Phone app. A phone app. So, so, so then the, they could have the Bluetooth on the back in a phone app and... So you can similar to get it on the mm -hmm. go when you're exercising right. or for... Similar for to a Fitbit, they have the app and then also the wearable device. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Thank you.